Hello, it's Technology Central here, and welcome to the fourth tutorial in our seven part tutorial series on how to use Google Docs. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to insert a table of contents and how to navigate your document using the document outline. Before we can get started, you need to format your document in a particular way. I have some lorem ipsum here with various headings that I've added. The title should be formatted using the title option. Then each major heading formatted as heading one. If you want any subheadings, format them as heading two. If you want even further subheadings, heading three. Now let's view our document in the document outline. On the left hand side of your screen, you should have an option to show the document outline. Click it and it will bring up your document outline. Here we can see our title and then each of the headings. We can see we've made section 1.1 and 1.2 a subsection of section 1. What appears here will be whatever you have written in any of these formatted sections. To jump to a section, simply click it in your document outline and it'll jump us to that section. To close the document outline, click this arrow. Now let's insert a table of contents. Select where we want our table of contents to go. Come to insert and come down to table of contents. You have two options, either to display with page numbers or with clickable hyperlinks. Let's start by inserting with page numbers. As you can see, we've had our table of contents created automatically with each of the headings appearing in our table of contents. If you make a change to your document, for example, I want to make this 1.1.0, then simply come to your table of contents and click the refresh option. And that will now update your table of contents to reflect the latest changes. You can use this table of contents for navigation by clicking on one of these options and then clicking the link that appears below it. And that will jump you to the relevant part of your document. We can also change this to be a links table of contents. I'm going to delete our table of content. I'm now going to come to insert table of contents and select with blue links. Here we have our table of contents and now our table of contents is a series of links. Again, we click on the link and select here to jump to that part of our document. That's all we've got to show you in this tutorial. I hope you found it useful. If you have, leave a like, subscribe and leave us a comment. Also, check out the rest of the tutorials in this series on our channel. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye.